السلام علیکم دس از احمد قیوم ون آف مائی بردر حامد بن فیاد ہو رنز این اسلامک پبلشنگ کمپنی ان نیوزی لینڈ ریکویسٹیڈ می ٹو ریکارڈ ہاؤ ٹو رائٹ قرآن ٹیکسٹ ان اڈابی ان ڈیزائن ان انگلش لینگویج سو آئی ہیو آلریڈی ریکارڈیڈ تھری ویڈیوز آن دس اسپیسیفک ٹاپک بٹ دے آل آر ان اردو سو ناؤ دس ٹائم دا اسٹیپس آر دا سیم بٹ ناؤ اٹس ان انگلش لینگویج so that other people uh, who do not understand urdu so they can also learn how to write quran text in adobe indesign or any other tool so method will be the same so you can use the same method for writing quran text in adobe illustrator and adobe photoshop as well so let's start uh, this is one of the sample that i just tried and let me show you that how i wrote this quran text in adobe indesign get back to google chrome so i will share these two website inside the video description so one is read.quranexplorer.com and the second one is quran.mursil.com so this this website is for where we will uh, copy the quran text so let's set our initial properties and then we will copy the text let me delete this one so that we can start from scratch so let's create a frame tool and just write just click to write a text so if i write so it it's writing english characters so let's set the properties go to windows type and tables and open paragraph there is a very small menu icon on the top right corner click on it and select adobe world ready single line composer go to character so okay so for selecting the font you need to install go to quran.mursil.com and download these two fonts nure hira and this one so i do not know how to pronounce pronounce its name so it start with a c h e so you you have to download these two fonts i have tried other fonts as well but these fonts are working correctly so just download them and remember their name go back to adobe indesign and let's right here nure hira and the blue r and select this one nure hira and set the size as 36 points yeah so let's get back to the paragraph and set it as starts from right yeah so if i click here yeah you can see that the cursor is blinking on the right side and the text size is set to 36 now let's go back to google chrome and copy the text so surah kahf is opened in front of me that is chapter number 18 so i'm copying the first aya from this chapter just press control c get back to adobe indesign and press control v so yeah so you have to verify that it's every single character is perfect it should not be there should not be any mistake uh, before you export the file so please verify uh, that every single thing is 100% correct so you can read and you can verify the text yeah so let's try the same method with some other ayat copy this one get back to adobe indesign so when i say that this method is 95% working so let's copy the complete aya till here and let's see what are going to be what are the results paste so yeah there you can see 
this one this tool has not recognized this these characters correctly so what we can do is we can maybe we can change the font and let's see that if we can find if we can fix it so s c h e the other font that we downloaded so no it's also not picking it correctly let's remove it so the, these are the few things that these fonts do not recognize get back to this website and let's try some other text so what you can do here is maybe you can add those uh, aya breaks by yourself you can just design and you can write inside so for example i want to write uh, one in arabic so what i can do is uh, just click here and write one select this one change your uh, system language go to arabic turn on your keyboard show keyboard viewer and make it as one so let's write one again okay so we need to change the the font so let's give it a name as sorry switch back to english and now write nurehera nurehera yeah one and give it a size as Thirty-six, or maybe less. So maybe you can create these uh, aya breaks by yourself. You can make adjustment to it. You can create uh, this thing in some other tool, and then you just have to place them at the end of each aya. If uh, your tool is not recognizing these type of characters, so this is how you can make adjustment to it. So let's let me show you that what other things are not working for this method so yeah so these characters these one little one on the top so let's try let's try this one hatta is a let's make it here copy make a copy to this font select and paste so yeah here you can see the arrangement of the words you see that the tool wrote these words first and then this one that is before this specific thing so now it's creating some trouble for me so let's try this with the other font s c h e still it's not perfect so what i can do here is uh, i can copy this text first and then i can copy the other text so these are the few problems that i am still facing and i do not know how to fix them so still i cannot find the exact position of the cursor where i need to paste the second part of the aya so yeah you can see that still there are some issues and you need to fix them by yourself manually so I request if someone who is watching this video and he knows how to fix these things, then please uh, send me a message and let's have a conversation so that uh, we, we can find a better solution 
to for writing Quran in such design products. So let me know that what are your views, what are your thoughts about this method and where are you going to implement it. See you in the next video. Thank you so much.